Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a grocery haul for you. It is Monday and this grocery haul is gonna be a little bit different. Now you guys know if you watch my budget updates or my other grocery hauls that I have been trying to grocery shop once every two weeks. I am completely just throwing that out the window for the month of October. I just got off track at the beginning and it just never got back on. So this is going to be for one week. Um, it looks a little bit different and doesn't really seem like a full grocery haul because we are super busy this week. We are busy all weekend long and will not be eating at home. And my mom comes on Tuesdays like once per month, she'll cook for the kids. Sometimes it's twice per month. If it so happens that my husband's working late and I'm working late on the same Tuesday and that happens this Tuesday. So she will be taking care of dinner on Tuesday. I don't think she knows how much I appreciate that. It is like a huge weight off. As I go through what I bought at Aldi, I will definitely share with you guys, um, you know, what I plan on using it for. Um, other things that we're gonna do this weekend is we have a birthday party on Saturday that we're gonna be eating at. It's a costume party. Sunday, my mom is having big family dinner and pumpkin carving at her house, so we're not gonna need to eat dinner at home that night. So it's just really, really like an odd grocery haul. I spent $60 at Aldi. I also, um, when we were at the pumpkin patch, went to their farmer's market that they have there and spent right around $10 or $11. So I'll I'll be sure to go ahead and add that into the total at the end of this video and let me share with you guys what I got at Aldi. Okay, so the first thing I got was one dozen eggs. They were 48 cents and I'm planning on using these for um, some egg and cheese burritos. Um, we're gonna have like a breakfast for dinner uh, night one night. I have some shredded hash browns left. I have some stuff. I just need to use up some things in the freezer and so I bought a dozen of eggs to do a really quick breakfast for dinner. Um, Honeycrisp apples were two pounds for $1.99. That's a pretty good deal. These are our favorite apples and so I did pick up some of those. I got a big thing of all-purpose flour. I'm planning on making homemade pancakes when I make the egg and cheese um, burritos in hash browns um, for dinner. And um, my flour just needs replaced. I don't use flour a ton and I need it for two recipes this week. Um, the pancake recipe and then also a loaded baked potato soup recipe I'm making for our community group for church on Friday night. So I definitely needed some more flour. I got grapes. How about Aldi's is selling stuff per pound now? It's kind of crazy to me because our Aldi's would be like, oh, you get the whole bag for like $2.98. Now grapes were per pound, um, bananas were per pound. Kind of odd, um, but these grapes ended up being $1.98, I think, for the whole bag of gr red grapes, and that's great. All of my kids and my family like those. I got a cucumber for salad. Sorry about the glare. This time of day, like... It's just so sunny in my kitchen. Um, I got some cherry tomatoes. My friend gave us so, so many big um, regular tomatoes from her garden that we need to use up, but my son likes taking these um, in his lunches and we eat them a lot for snacks and I take them for my lunch and they're just, I love like grape or cherry tomatoes. I got a big thing of baking potatoes and that is gonna be for the loaded baked potato soup. I would probably use, I would say, nearly all of that bag. I think I'm gonna do baked potatoes or mashed potatoes with chicken one night, and then the rest of them will be for that loaded baked potato soup. I got some bananas. They're pretty green, but that means they'll last. I'm gonna try to have the kids eat up um, a little bit of strawberries we have left in the fridge and some green grapes that are really need to be eaten up first before we eat bananas. Uh, then I have these bacon pieces. This is gonna be for the loaded baked potato soup. Some sweet butter lettuce for salad, some mozzarella cheese. I am going to be making pizza cups for my son's lunches and I might share that or you may see it in my lunch videos, but I bought the big one pound bag of pre-shredded mozzarella cheese. These look so good. Some pumpkin spice cookie mix. Um, just looks like something that I would really, really like and it was only like $1.49, so that'll be fun to do with the kids uh, and just make those up for lunches and for desserts. I bought a pizza. Tonight I wanted to do a really easy dinner, so we're gonna do pizza and salad. And these are only $5.99 and that's a really, really good, simple dinner. I got some yogurt tubes. My kids love these. Some turkey sausage snacks for homemade Lunchables. 
my youngest son, he was not with me, but he had requested that I get French toast sticks. He asked like eight times this morning, and so I bought them for him because I'm a pushover. And tortilla chips for snacking and lunches. We got some hard salami, some sharp cheddar cheese for Lunchables. This significantly spicy hummus. I haven't had it in a while and I really do like it. And so I bought some of that to take in my lunches. Some queso for chips and cheese. This chicken broth is going to be for the loaded baked potato soup. And then I bought some milk because I need quite a bit of milk for the baked potato soup recipe. I'm also planning on, like I said, making mashed potatoes and I bought some cereal. So we needed some milk. I got some goldfish crackers, some of these buttery round crackers for Lunchables, some pub style pretzels. We really like those and some pretzel thins. I probably didn't need both of those, but I saw these after I already picked those up. I got some chocolate chip mini muffins and my favorite, some Count Chocula. Um, I let them have this for like an evening snack after they get home from their activities sometimes and my older son absolutely loves it. But being honest, I could just eat the whole entire box for dinner. I love sugary junk cereal. I got some chewy chocolate chip granola bars. I'm hoping that my son will eat these because he has been eating every single chocolate chip granola bar and actually asked for them today and I was out. Uh, some pizza sauce for those pizza cups that I'm gonna make for my son's lunches. Some refried beans and some olives. I like olives on our salads and I also take olives um, with like some salami and cheese with like for lunches. I do olives, hummus, salami, cheese, you know, that kind of thing for my lunches on days that I work. I got some organic macaroni and cheese just because they were out of the regular macaroni and cheese. Some peanut butter crackers for lunches and I also got a case of water. So that is all I got. The total was $60.10. Like always, I will stick my total for the week here. And then I will stick my total for the entire month of October at the very end. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Um, if you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up and I will talk to you next time. Bye-bye.